Welcome to day 16 of our January Challenge 2023 and our play along videos. So we are working on the first four bars of the melody. So we're ignoring the introduction, going straight in onto the melody. And it sounds like this and I will count you in and we'll do it nice and steady first of all. Um, I think I said in the teaching video that I was going to do a really steady speed and then gradually build it up um, so that we just get that feeling of the timing and then we nudge it notch it up step by step okay so i'm going to go really nice and slowly first of all da, 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 da. that kind of speed okay it actually becomes easier to put the flow in once it's quicker but i want you to get the combination of which hands with which all right here we go three and four and So let's do that again. This an opening pattern happens a lot in this piece, these first two bars of it. So it's a really good one to get comfortable with as well. Okay, I'm gonna go a little bit faster. Ya da 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 ba -di da ready? Okay, three and four and do that speed one more time for you. Remember the right hand's thumb on the E, third on the D. Three, uh, yeah, da, da, da. three and four and. Okay, we'll do one more time at that speed and then I'll do an even faster one again for those that want it. But that's a nice flowing speed now. I'll give you a full bar in this time. So one, two, three and four and. Good work, okay. Um, keep playing that until it really starts to feel like it's actually wanting to do you know like your muscle memory is kicking in and it's wanting to do it on it on its own without you having to think so hard so keep doing that i'll do a slightly faster speed just to finish then we'll go okay we'll do that together for those that want to you might just want to play the left hand or just listen one two three four Okay, now um, if we take that D and F off here and instead add the D and the F above middle C, want, I want you to now have a go at playing this an octave lower, okay? So we'll do that down there. So just take all those notes, so think where you were and then just transpose that down the octave. Put the fingers and thumbs on the same notes, put an octave lower, okay? Go a little bit slower again, we'll go da 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 da. Okay, try that together. One and two and three and four and. Brilliant, okay. And I don't want you to overthink that. It is just the same notes, but an octave lower. Okay, and you're going to need that later on in the piece. Okay, because later on the piece we have a DC, a da capo, um, and it's al, and it's repeated an octave lower. So it's not written out an octave lower. So you need to be comfortable with playing it an octave lower, even though it's written the way it is. Okay, well done. I will see you tomorrow for the next stretch. Well done. <laughs> 